And we continue to search for the critical information that many of you are asking us about. Where can people get a COVID-19 vaccine? Well, starting today, major pharmacies like CVS and Walgreens began vaccinating seniors. For those who are still trying to find an appointment, here's two on your side's Jeff Preval. Just another example of how fast COVID-19 vaccine appointments are going this morning. We found an appointment Sunday at the Walgreens on Hurdle Lab in Buffalo. Seconds later, it was gone. Starting today, major pharmacies, CVS and Walgreens began vaccinating seniors. We continue to hear from a lot of people trying to book an appointment through their local pharmacy. They are recommended to continue checking pharmacy websites. Today at Genesee Community College in Batavia, essential workers and seniors were being vaccinated. Next week, Genesee County anticipates receiving at least 100 doses of vaccine. As we get our allocations over the weekend, so usually Saturday or Sunday, I'll get an email with how many doses we're going to be receiving, uh, and those usually come in anywhere from Tuesday or Wednesday. What happens to those limited vaccine appointments? But we're going to continue to uh, have to prioritize the, what the state tells us we have to, which is um, essential workers right now at the health department. Uh, starting next week, we can do, again, comorbidity with special allocations for that uh, and again we're going to look to you know, again try to uh, loop in our, our folks 65 and older as best as we can. Many county health departments tell us they're not making new appointments until they have vaccine in hand. That's been the case for the past few weeks. In Niagara County officials say they expect to do 400 first dose vaccines a week from today. Meantime Erie County Health is still playing catch up on canceled appointments from last month due to lack of supply and that it's anticipated to take the rest of the month to get through the backlog. Now, starting on Monday, the state will allow those with underlying health issues and compromised immune systems to become eligible to receive the vaccine. Another group added with not enough doses to go around. In Batavia, I'm Jeff Perval, Channel 2 News.